In this lesson, we want to talk about array object. Array object is a simple, colo a simple cloner that clone uh, radially your object. For example, I have a coin here, insert a coin, <coughs> and simply uh, holding Alt and click on array to array. As you can see, it's array radially your coin and simply you can change it in the settings you can change the radius you can change the copy of the clone and other settings are for animating it okay uh, this animation is moving up and down with amplitude you can amplitude it as you can see here i set the uh, array frequency to zero to explain later and for uh, <clears throat> execute the animation you have to play that in the timeline you have to play we increase the frame in a 1000 to play to have a more room for playing and as you can see when you play nothing happen because this is amplitude it's just moving for example in this any number that you type here in y direction you need the frequency for example one to uh, trigger that moving and as you can see <clears throat> the amplitude control the how amount uh, the control the position and the frequency uh, control the speed for example five we have uh, more movement and the array frequency add a wave for example i change it to one and now we have one wave if you change it to two we have two wave and you can increase it as you want and this is ours and in a previous lesson i explained the render instance in the detail you can refer to them but it's very simple if you click that it's uh, ready for render and it's a fast for moving and rendering in your scene okay it is array and i want to say something set it all to zero to make them in its position okay for example as you can see my main color my main coin is here that is array here I want to change uh, I want to change orientation of this cone in some direction. If you rotate the main object does not affect it because you have to change the orientation. In a parametric object we have something orientation and here it's benefit. you can change your orientation and the orientation of the array will be changed. It's not in a <clears throat> array parameter settings it's in the main object setting you can change the orientation here if you want to change uh, your desired orientation you have to access here you have to enable access as i said before in a previous lessons you have to make editable your parametric object to access the to enable the access and you have you for changing the orientation of the uh, array or clone you have to change the axis or orientation of the object if you if i click on a coin and here we do not have any uh, orientation here so you have to enable axis here in this button and then you can click and drag and change orientation of the uh, object as you can see the main object is maintaining rotation just the axis will be rotated and now you can rotate in any direction in a array okay that's array hello my friends to continue these tutorials on youtube subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release